turn and face each other, hold each other's hands. Perfect, right there. We are gathered here on this 26th day of May 2018 for the marriage ceremony of Frank and Betty. I want to welcome you to the lucky little chapel and let's open with a word of prayer. Father, thank you for this couple that stands here. Your word tells us that this is the day that you've made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. So we rejoice with Frank and Betty on their beautiful day. I ask that you bless every moment of their marriage. Let their hearts be filled with great joy and let peace be their portion. And we pray and we ask all these things in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Marriage is honorable and it shouldn't be entered into lightly. It's the two of you hand in hand and heart in heart, loving one another. It's also you two saying that your love is so strong that today you'd like to form a bond that will last a lifetime. So having that understanding, Frank, do you take Betty to be your wife and do you promise to love and comfort, honor and keep her, and remain faithful to her? I do. Betty, do you take Frank to be your husband and do you promise to love and comfort Honor and keep him and remain faithful to him. I do. Frank, you'll go first. Please repeat your vow after me. I, Frank. I, Frank. Take you, Betty. Take you, Betty. To be my wife. To be my wife. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. In sickness or in health. In sickness or in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Forever and ever. Forever and ever. This is my promise to you. This is my promise to you. Betty, please repeat after me. I, Betty. I, Betty. Take you, Frank. Take you, Frank. To be my husband. To be my husband. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. In sickness or in health. In sickness or in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Forever and ever. Forever and ever. This is my promise to you. This is my promise to you. Today you will exchange your rings. Rings are endless circles, which is symbolic of your love. Also, rings are made out of a strong substance. When you get married, today you become stronger. That means if one of you goes through a tough time, the other one is there to help them. Great. Place that on her left ring finger. Please hold her hand and look in her eyes and repeat after me with this ring. With this ring. Today I wed. Today I wed. Receive it as a symbol. Receive it as a symbol. Of my love. Of my love. Okay. Place that on his left ring finger. And please repeat after me. With this ring. With this ring. Today I wed. Today I wed. Receive it as a symbol. Receive it as a symbol. Of my love. Of my love. I want to go ahead and play, push the ring up. I want to share with you just a few more words, starting with a poem entitled, An Uncommon Love. May you have the love only two can know. May you go where only two as one may go. May the sun rise and set in your bonded hearts, and the moon never find you too long apart. May you cherish each other's dreams as your own, and turn stumbling blocks into stepping stones. May you brave life's mountains and miles together. May there be no storm your love cannot weather. May you be lovers and allies and friends, and may your soul's conversation never end. May you capture on earth what's in heaven above. May your hearts know the rapture of an uncommon love. I want to encourage you to do three things in your marriage. Number one, communicate. Say, I love you as much as you can. If you get frustrated or even upset, talk about that, but then forgive each other, which means to give each other a clean slate. Secondly, make sure you laugh, celebrating life together and having fun. Laughter releases stress in your body and it does the same thing for your marriage. Finally, love each other, unconditionally and selflessly. Never let anything nor anyone come in between you. Let love be your anchor and no matter what you face, your love will carry you through every storm. So as you two begin this beautiful journey, love, laugh, and communicate. By doing so, you will enjoy a long, prosperous, and blessed marriage together. But now, you're welcome. Now that you, Frank and Betty, have consented together in matrimony, you've exchanged your rings and your vows. 
by the laws and authority of the state of Nevada, it's my honor and privilege to pronounce you husband and wife. Frank, you may kiss your beautiful bride. Go ahead and stop right there, you two. Big smiles looking right here at the camera. Give each other a kiss. Perfect. Do you guys want to say something to your guests? Come on back here, you can say hi right there where you're standing right there.